The next NDC government commits to implementing targeted affirmative action measures aimed at bringing significant development gaps and accelerating growth in Zungo communities and inner city areas. This is aimed at promoting social equity, stimulating economic development and fostering social inclusion for a more balanced and prosperous Ghana. To achieve these goals, we will establish the Soeya Fund to provide working capital for SMEs in Zungo communities. We will also reduce the extremely high hard fares in the lifetime of every Muslim attending or experiencing Hajj even, for, even once in their lifetime is a desired objective. Currently and in the last past eight years, Hajj fares have become extremely high. It is one of the objectives of Excellency John Damani Mahama and the NDC. We will also initiate an educational infrastructure program to expand educational infrastructure in Zongo and inner cities, including establishing three new Islamic secondary schools in the northern middle and southern belts. We would also establish STEM and TVET model schools in selected regions to serve selected Zungu communities. The next NDC government would also commence an infrastructure upgrade of the Al-Faru College of Education. It is worthy to note that in 2015, even though the Al-Faru College of Education is a private institution, His Excellency John Amani Mahama started the process to expand access at the, at the college. We would also facilitate accreditation of Islamic schools, such as the Institute of Islamic Research, to support the training of more Arabic school teachers. The next NDC government would also provide scholarships to Zongo and inner city students, particularly in the fields of law, medicine, and engineering, and ICT. We will also facilitate partnerships to establish Islamic tertiary institutions and link Zongo and inner city communities to opportunities under the National Apprenticeship Program. Salaam Alaikum.